finish the first mile. Did the first mile at eight minutes and 40, which is pretty fucking bad. But uh, I'll get there. Haven't rained in a while. My wind's not as good as it used to be either. So, you know, I'm gonna cut it here. Got a call coming in. All right, it's the end of the day. Um, so I ended up doing the, I think I mentioned it earlier today. I had a call come through, so I didn't finish saying what I was saying. So I'll just recap based on what I did in the morning. I ended up doing three miles, um, a couple 50 meter. Well, not exactly. I didn't, I couldn't measure the 50 meters. So I did post to post like light poles or uh, what they had on the track, which I'm pretty sure was uh, either 40 yards or something around there. And I did sprint jogs for a good lap. Um, did some mobility stuff in the beginning. Uh, damn, there's no light over here. Um, stretching, all that. Tested myself on a mile. I did it at 850, which is really bad. But I feel like a lot of that is gonna, in a week's time, right? Because I have a week uh, till April 7th. It is April 1st tomorrow. So that will give me a full seven days uh, to get to where I need to be. Um, well, no, it'll give me about six days because the day before, well, seventh day would be the day of the test and the day before. So give me five days. Yeah, I think it's five days because Saturday I'm doing a double walk. So I recover from all the training I'm going to do for the running. But I did. I just got done now doing a hit training. Um, and then I did a... Uh, for the rest of the time, for the 45-minute walk, I did a, I stretched out, and then I did a fast-paced, uh, like, sprint jog. Um, I'm walking now. Um, watched a couple videos. If there's anybody that runs and knows a lot about running, any tips or advice in the comments, I'd appreciate it. Uh, just finished the 45 minutes now. All right. Uh... Yeah, I'm trying to keep it at 150 because somebody was saw uh, one of the guys was saying to get I'm like trying to get uh, your 180 minus your age. So I'm 30 now. So that would put me at 150 for my heart rate. And uh, but that pace is extremely slow. So I don't really know. And a week's time, it's not a lot of time for you to even practice or train for this. And I understand that. But I've got the mental discipline that I've cultivated from doing this program on my side. So when it comes down to it, I, I could fucking just push hard and just do it. And just go hard when it, when it all comes down to it. And just, uh, you know, be fucked up the next day. It's not a big deal for me. Um, and just operate like that for the following day. So, um, I'm just going to try to do some long distance running. That way I can get my wind up, my stamina. It's also going to give me more practice in the running department and the mechanics of it. Watching some videos on, uh, stabbing the, with my balls and my, the ball of my feet when I'm running. Um changed up the weight routine for tomorrow um for these days it's going to be two days on a day off two days on and those that's about all the training i'm going to be able to get until it's time to uh you know do that recovery day for the for the uh for the i still gotta take those christmas lights down over there. um for that recovery day that i'm going to take before the walk gallon out here finish this up just finished just have to take my picture now uh, but you guys will see next episode what I have set up a lot more supersets and surrogate style stuff 
and that's really uh like what i know i can do in this time for sure is get my stamina up and get uh focus on working on my breathing and uh the mechanics on running try to build some sort of habit in these couple days or get more familiar with correcting my uh my running be more conscious of it while i'm doing this stuff and yeah it might not be the best that i can uh that i can get but in the time that i have i'm going to get some sort of return from working on this especially with the stamina so i'll just run i'll run hot on uh when i do the mile and a half for the uh cooper test for the uh for the police thing the pt thing so i'll just run fucking hard get my stamina up so it's faster and just sharpen up on certain things i have a vertical lead so i put some speed and uh, uh, agility drills in the workout, which is real different for me. So <laughs> when it comes down to the, the workout stuff, so I'm gonna have to cut down on, uh, which sucks, but I'll go back to it once I do pass the PT test because the, the academy will probably be months down the line. So. I'll be able to get a more hybrid athlete style workout situated after this. But uh, right now, it's going to be, I know my weak points to running. So I'm going for the running calisthenics. I could do it. I just did sit ups. Um, I tested that. I tested my push ups. I can do in the minute, I can do. I could do like 70 push-ups in a minute. 60 to 70 push-ups in a minute, I know that. I didn't test that today, but I know that I could do that. Out there, I did the sit-ups. I did, I did 30 in a minute right now. Full sit-ups. So, the HIIT training has abdominals in it every day. And I'm going to be doing a lot of raise. I'm going to be doing a lot of stuff in the gym, so switching it up and uh with that work that i do get done then i take that recovery day i'll do the two walks that way i still follow the program um the following day i'll be fresh and i think with what i do the work i put in right now uh till that day i should be good to go so you guys will also be following me not just on the 75 hour program but for me going from 850 in a mile it was 15.50 for a mile and a half, but I did a whole mile and a half after the mile. So I was kind of not fresh, but you know, that's bad. So I'm gonna try to get to, it was almost nine, so sub seven minute mile, six minute, fuck that six minute mile, six minute mile. And for the mile and a half, I wanna I wanna get ten. Sub eleven. Sub eleven minutes. I could get like ten minutes, ten ten thirty for a mile and a half. That's good. That would be good for, for my weight, I feel like. <clears throat> yep, that's it guys. I'm gonna end the video here. Did all that. Um those are the plans I've set. I wrote down a lot of stuff already, and, uh, yeah, you will see the progress, and I guess, uh, I'll have everything, my times and everything from after the test, I'll probably wear the watch and figure out, uh, Alright guys, I'll see you next episode. Peace.